Okay, if you look closely, I have sunlight passing through the uh, ferrosphere, but when I place it like this, if you actually take a look in the upper right of the video, you can actually see that I'm using a neodymium magnet behind here, which is right there, to uh, split up the sunlight as it's passing through the uh, special ferrofluid solution. So with a magnet attached to a ferrosphere, or actually suspending a magnet inside a ferrosphere, which I know how to do, you can actually have sunlight. You remember the old prisms back in the day where it actually cast rainbows on the wall? What if instead of that, we actually had a device that would to take the sunlight and actually split it up using magnetism so we'd have visible light this uh, cell phone video doesn't do it justice but it's actually quite astonishing let me get up above off a little bit of the side here. Not so easy to capture this on video. Not when I'm trying to do this and hold a camera with the other hand at the same time. It's actually quite <laughs> remarkable to look at. So I'm using the ferrosphere a one inch cube magnet and nature's sunlight I thought you would think that was really cool it's a lot cooler in person than it is through the crappy little uh, video that I'm shooting right now Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you later.